Hey, I bet you're a bit like me. And I bet you, when you look and you analyze and, and think how I'm going to become great at what I'm doing in this, in our profession here um, with Juice Plus and Network Marketing, is you have to know all the answers. And that couldn't be further from the truth <laughs> and the biggest misconception in what we do and what the actually what the greats do and I'm aspiring to be and I keep studying these greats and what the greats do is they ask questions they find out what is important to the person before them you know how's your relationships right now hey have you ever thought about being an entrepreneur Hey, have you ever thought about being able to take an extra vacation or so a year? Have you ever thought about maybe just buying a vacation home, right? Have you ever thought about starting a charity? Have you ever, you know, start thought about doing things with your church? Have you ever thought about what it would be like to be able to live without having to worry about finances, about sending your kids to, you know, maybe this or that? Ask them questions, right? And then shut up and let them speak about what's important to them. You see... We are also like horses. We are so stubborn. And if a horse doesn't want to move, it's not going to move. And we've all heard the adage, you can take a horse to water, you can't make it drink. Asking questions makes it thirsty. And it allows you to direct the horse to the answers. So if you ask the proper questions and hear what they're saying and listen, excuse me, what they're saying, now you can get the, the, the important information that's important to them. See, what amateurs tend to do is we, and I've done this, you know, we're fire hydrant and we spit a lot of information at people. When you ask questions, you don't have to be a pro. That person tells you what they need and you are able to fill that need with your product, service, or idea. And so once you figure this out and what their needs are, here's the closing question. If I could, would you? This creates reciprocation. When you reciprocate, when you ask something, people automatically want to help back. But you have to qualify it first with these questions. You have to know what it is they want. You don't need to be interesting. No one's more interesting than the person who sits before you. <laughs> so if you just listen to what they're saying, they'll tell you what they need. And then if you say they want to be an entrepreneur, hey, if I could show you how to be an entrepreneur and do this within the time confinements of your day with minimal investment, would you be willing to take a look at it? You know, listening to your health concerns and what you're dealing with, if I could share with you a product that could help you with that, would you take a look at it? Would you like to give it a try? And as soon as they agree, you shut up and do it. When they agree to take a look at the business, we will send them a business video. We are creating reciprocation. What we're doing is we're providing questions that they're giving answers to. They're telling us exactly what they need. And when they tell that to us, we're taking this information now and we're customizing everything to them. And we're teaching them in the process how to do this art of what we're doing. We're duplicating what we are doing, okay? And so now they're learning this before they even jump on board. And then we send them the information. Hey, what did you like about that? Well, you know, I really like this. Awesome. You know, one out of 10, one's your minimal. You know, ready to get involved. 10, you are ready to jump on board. Where do you feel you're at? Well, I'm like a six or a seven. Great. What, you know, now that I know this, what information would you need to see for me to be able to send you, to inform you and educate you so that you could take another look and get started in this? I need to see this. Awesome. <laughs> this is what you're doing. And you're just back and forth, back and forth. I pray that this makes sense, and I hope I've gotten, given you a little bit of information today. But just remember, it's all about them. Ask them questions, and it just leads you down the path where you need to go to help them. It's about them, not us. And it's about providing them with solutions and opportunities. I hope this has been helpful and beneficial, and I pray to God in every day and every way that you and your family get better and better.